I'm going to be knocking on people's homes in an attempt to enter them. However, I am actually a vampire. It seems like I don't have clothes and I do look like a vampire. We have 31 homes to attend to, so why don't we get our nice little clothes on? I look fabulous. Hi. Yo, what's popping fam? You here for the kicks or what? The kicks. What is a kick? Yo, I'm totally up for the kicks too. Oh my god, that's so bad. <laughs> I'm totally- That's what I'm talking about, what kind of kicks are you rocking? Does he mean shoes? What kind of kicks am I rocking? I don't know what he's on about! Oh you know, just the casual kicks I've got going on right now. What about you? What kind of kicks are you rocking? Oh my god, I don't know what this is. What have I got myself into? How the hell? I stay flexing in my fresh Jordans, man. Can't go with- oh, So he does mean shoes. Those classics, but I'm always hunting for the next heat. You feel me? Oh, I feel you. Oh, kicks are one of my best hobbies in this entire world. I love to get new kicks every week. Yo, oh, you are man, the real no. deal, my friend. Getting the new kicks every week. That's dedication right there. What's your favorite brand to cop? I don't know what I'm talking about here. Jordans are my favourite brand to cop right now. I love myself some Jordans. I'm just copying him because I don't know what I'm on about. Oh snap, Jordans are fire. Can't go wrong with those classics. Which number Jordans are your go-to? Just say a random number and hope for the best. Oh, the number 12s are my favourite. No doubt the 12s are sick. Gotta love that sleek design. <laughs> Man, we gotta link up sometime and check out each other's collections. You down for that? Oh, I'm down. Why don't I go and come in and check your collection right now? That's what I'm talking about. Come in, my dude. My sneaker game is on point. You won't be disappointed. Let's vibe and appreciate the art of our feet. Oh, yes, I've done it. Oh, I'm I'm the best. Oh, you don't have... I don't see a shoes collection anywhere in his home. Oh, my stars are garters. Little swipe. Is that my name? What a surprise to see you at my doorstep, darling. How delightful. I hope you come bearing some of that groovy Gen Z lingo to spice up this old lady's evening. Why, yes, I have. I decided that I'm going to be bringing you one of my favourite pair of Jordans to keep. All yours, no charge. Oh my goodness, how kind of you, dearie, but I simply couldn't accept that such generous gift, you see. These old bones don't need fancy shoes to get around, but bless your heart for thinking of me. Well, you're welcome, Grandma Maud. Well, I've also brought over some gardening tools, because I know you have been getting into gardening recently, as well as some baking some cookies. That would be fun. What am I even saying? Oh, you sweet thing, gardening tools and cookies, you really know the way to this old lady's heart. I do love a gardening session and the thought of fresh baked cookies fills my heart with delight. Just promise me you won't tell anyone about my secret cookie stash, alright? Don't worry, Grandma Maud, I won't let anyone know about your secret cookie stash. Cross my heart. Well, 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 dearie, you have won this old lady's heart. I simply can't resist someone with a craving for cookies. Come on in. Oh, she's just letting me in like that. Oh, poor Grandma Maud. She doesn't know what's got coming into her. Oh, I feel so bad. The game has crashed on me, so we're going to just go to a random house now and then just hope for the best. Grandma Maud is still alive. What in the tarnation do you want knocking on my door at this ungodly hour? Could you kindly explain yourself before I decide to unleash my wrath upon ya? Ooh. Rusty Outrage, right. He looks, he gives scary energy. I, I don't know why I've been knocking on his door. Like, that's the scary part. When you're knocking on someone's door, how do I start a conversation? Sorry to disturb you, Rusty Outrage. I was just wondering if you want to share a beer or two that I've stashed in my back pocket. <laughs> what was that? He loves that. Well, now you got my attention. Ain't nothing like a good old beer to take the edge off. But how about you show me them hiding beers before I decide you're not worth sharing them with? Oh, I don't have beers in my pocket. Shows beer to rusty outrage. 
Well, dang it all. Those bears sure look like mine too tempting. Considering your honesty and generosity, I reckon I can let you in for a bit, but my- Oh my gosh, she's letting me in! That fool. Too easy. Oh my gosh! Hey there, Cosmic Traveller. What's tickling your soul in this magical moonlit evening? Peace and love, and my friend. Hello, Eve. We've not spoken quite a bit. Remember me, Rusty Outrage? I was just wondering how you're doing. That's not gonna let them- they're not gonna let me in from that. I, I, oh no, she doesn't like me. Hey there, Rusty Outrage. I'm Groovy, just following with the cosmic energies, you know. How's the universe treating you? Oh, well, right now, I'm afraid. I feel like I need to join your movement and also do what you do. Oh, she likes that! Oh, my celestial friend, I'm sending you healing vibes and positive energy. I'll be honored to share my knowledge with you. Let's embark on this journey together, exploring the path of yogic bliss and inner peace. That's what I need. Lots of peace. I just need to feel a tranquil atmosphere and feel free. That's going to get her for sure. Okay. Oh, I feel you, my cosmic companion. Peace and freedom are essential for the soul. You're welcome to join me anytime for the more Sina yoga sessions in nature. Let's find that tranquility together and harmonizing with the rhythm of the universe. Do you have an yeah. indoor pool by chance? Just curious. Ah, you have noticed my ducky float. It's my little reminder to embrace playfulness and childlike wonder. Unfortunately, I don't have an indoor pool at the moment, but I do have a beautiful nature pond nearby where I can take a dip and connect with the elements. Trust me, the experience will be pure bliss, my friend. Oh my gosh, I should go try that out. I would love to do that. Take that pool dip. What was that? <laughs> She likes it! Oh, I'm delighted that you're excited about it. It would be my pleasure to have you join me. Gluten-free crisps. Would you mind eating some with me? Oh my gosh, what was that? That really got out of hand. So oh, how delightful sweet of you sharing gluten-free crisps! <laughs> it's like the perfect way to nourish our bodies and connect on a deeper level. Come on in, my friend! Oh, poor Eve! Oh, I got her. Oh, Eve, you're going down. I don't know who we're gonna call you, but you're not Eve, that's for sure. Oh, hello, Regina B. Right. Ugh, like, what are you doing at my door wearing that outfit? Did the thrift store run out of ironic t-shirts today? <gasps> anyway, like, what do you want? Well, Regina, I can see that you're not even wearing shoes. Now, who comes to a door not wearing shoes? That's really evil and weird of you, Regina, and you are just a disgusting person. I don't know why I decided to wear <laughs> Excuse me, you think you can just come to my door and insult me? You're looking at even bothered. Goodbye. What the heck do you want interrupting my misery parade? Tommy, don't feel like that. Is there anything I could do to cheer you up? What would you like? Do you want to share some lollipops together, Tommy? Why do I always resort to food? It's the only way to get people into houses. To resort to food. Yeah. Share lollipops? Are you kidding me? I'm walking heartbreak. Not some sugar addicted kid. But um, thanks for the offer, I what guess. What do we have here? Another lost hipster trying to rock the Santa look, huh? Sorry, but I don't have any arsenal gifts for you. Hey there, buddy. That was, oh gosh, no. Oh, I'm still speaking. Oh, that's not going well. You are the most beautiful Santa. Santa? I meant Santa. Would it say San Sensor? Oh, most beautiful oh, Sensor! <laughs> well, I have hazelnut. I have Nutella. I've got whole meat. I've got cradles. What am I on about? Oh dear. Oh dear. I didn't even say chocolate. It's not Nutella. Whole wheat. Goodness me. You've got quite the array of cookies, I must say. Oh my gosh, he's letting me in. He's letting me in. I thought he was kicking me out. Oh, Santa. Hero that's going to slay all of the dragons for you. I am your protector. I don't know where that went, but hopefully they like that. Eh? Lord and Saviour, Hero, the dragons. I am sorry, but I can't let you in right now. Good luck with your. 
Right, so that's not what they were trying to get at. Hello there! What the heck are you doing here at this ungodly hour? Can't you see I'm busy being grumpy? Get out of here! Well, don't I have the offer for you, Charles? Wouldn't you want to pick a selection after my treats? I've got chocolate, I've got tea cakes, I've got crisps. I want none of your happy treats. Now get out of my property before I call the cops. It's free! Oh, for God's sake, it's free! Oh, he needs to know it's free. Oh. Wait. 100% fresh. He loves fresh food. Knock. They're half naked. <laughs> I do appear to be half naked right now. I and mean, I do apologize for that. I was in a rush. I've got this 100% fresh food just for you, free of charge. Fresh food, huh? Well, I suppose free is hard to resist. You better not be trying to poison me, though. What kind of food is it? I don't know actually because it's in a box. <laughs> Those healthy snacks. Well, I'll be darned. Fresh fruits and veg, you say? Ain't nothing got the healthiest and against healthy snacks. All right, you can come on in, but don't think this means that you're best buddies now. Well, thank you, Charles, and I hope you do enjoy this. And don't worry, I won't tell a soul. This is just for you only. Let's head on in. That's, that was a perfect sentence right there. All right, kid, just this once you can come in, but remember, I don't like surprises, so don't go snooping around here. Shouldn't be less than the fresh fancy food. I don't know what he was talking about. And I wasn't even wearing clothes. Oh, my dear, what brings you to a sp sprightful young thing like yourself to my doorstep at this hour? Would you like a nice cup of tea, perhaps? Cookie to go with it? Oh, she's literally inviting us in. Oh, Grandma Hamad, that is exactly what I need right now. I'd love some tea and cookies. Um, how's your gardening getting on? My dear, how thoughtful of you to ask about my gardening. I must say, my roses are blooming like never before. Would you like me to show you around the garden while we enjoy our tea and cookies? That will be perfect, Grandma Maud. Thank you so much for inviting me into your lovely home. That was easy, guys. Come in, come in. Let's have a delightful afternoon in my humble abode. Just mind creaky floorboards. Oh no, poor girl. Well, Grandma Maud, I'm sorry, but yeah. Yeah, it's not what you expected, was it? Popping Grandma Maud, you caught me off in the middle of my rhymes. How can little swipe help you to- I don't know what he's saying. Little swipe, I never know what you're saying, but... Maybe one day I can learn. I was wondering if you would like these lost sneakers that I found on the ground. Oh snap, Grandma Maud, you found some kicks. That's wild. I appreciate the offer, but I'm about my signature sneakers. Well, it says that these are Jordans. Have you ever heard about Jordans before? I'm not too familiar myself, but um, is Jordans a good brand? He's gonna love this. Yo, Grandma Maud, you talking about Jordans? They're like iconic kicks. People go crazy for them. Good quality and all. So, yeah, they're definitely a good brand to flex with. Well, they're all in the packaging and um, everything. I was just wondering if you would like them free of charge, of course, because I just love helping people. No way, Grandma Maud. You're too generous. I'll be hella hyped to rock those Jordans. Oh, wow. That's perfect. He is useless. He doesn't know what's coming from him. <laughs> I mean, Bitcoin. He loves Bitcoin. How do we talk about Bitcoin? I have known nothing about Bitcoin. Hey there, Brian. So I was wondering about this whole Bitcoin stuff, and I don't really know anything about it, and I was wondering if you could teach me one-on-one. -on -one. Well, 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 Grandma Maud, you've come to the right place. Bitcoin is the sweetest thing since Grandma's apple pie. I'll be happy to teach you everything you need to know, but first, I've got to ask you, do you own any Bitcoin, Grandma Maud? I don't own any Bitcoin, but I would like to start today ASAP. I want to get my money into some Bitcoin and hopefully see some profits. Grandma Maud, you're a shining star in the crypto universe. Getting into Bitcoin is a bold move, and I'm here to support you every step of the way. First things first, let's set you up with a secure wallet to keep your Bitcoin safe. Shall we proceed? Thank you so much, Brian. You are just so helpful. But do you mind if I can take a seat on your sofa? My legs aren't what they used to be. Ha ha! <laughs> have to do a fake laugh. No problem at all, Grandma Mod. Please have a seat on my ultra comfy sofa. Now let's head on to the world of Bitcoin and get you on the way to the moon. He's not letting me in. Thank you so much, Brian. Let's head on in and let's start this Bitcoin journey together. Oh, I'm excited. Come on in. Oh, perfect. Oh, he's 
Once again, no one- I'm just I'm too good at this. Fashion advice or something. Okay, Raven. Let's just say it straight. My fashion sense is not doing the best. And I would love to get some fashion sense from Raven. Why am I speaking to her like she's not right in front of me? <laughs> Whoa, hold up. You think I can help with your fashion rules? All right. I'll give it a shot. What kind of vibe are you going for anyway? I was going for the grandma look, you know, but like a nice grandma that will bake you tea and cookies without charge. What? Am, why am I all about this money and food? <laughs> grandma chick, huh? I dig it. How about a flowy floral dress with some cute vintage inspiring accessories, throw on some comfy loafers and you'll have a sweet granny vibe in no time. Oh Raven, well thank you so much. I honestly say just looking at your fit right now, you are supreme Raven. Love your fit. I think you've got some serious good taste too. Wanna oh, she's just letting me in like that. Oh, okay. Wow, Raven. Konnichiwa, Raven-chan. Thank you. Totally obsessed with Demon Slayer. The animation is so beautiful and the characters. What about you? Have you seen? Oh, I don't know. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, I've got this. Oh, Attack on Titans has got to be my favourite right now. Although, all-time favourite, Notebook by far. One of my faves. Why do you love Attack on Titans? I love it so much. It's the storyline for me, like so many sad moments in Attack on Titans, it's got me tearing up speaking about it now. Does it? I don't know. Maybe it does, but I'm sure it does, right? What? I totally feel you. Attack on Titans definitely knows how to pull the heartstrings of intense moments to feel the tears. It's all part of the experience. And as for Notebook, well, love stories can just be emotional, right? So since we're both lovers of emotional anime, I think Notebook's not an anime actually. Is what I've now realised. I've gotten! Oh, I'm getting all the people that hated me before. You are a loser. Oh my god. Like, what are you doing knocking at my door at this hour? Ugh, can't you see that I'm busy filming my next TikTok? Well, Regina, I think I've just came to the right house. I'm actually TikTok famous. So if we do a collab, I can get you TikTok famous in no time. TikTok famous? Please, I'm already famous on social media platforms, sweetie, but I suppose I could take a look at your account. Maybe I'll grace you with a collaboration if you're lucky. Show me what you got. Well, I've even got something better. Have you ever heard of Red Artist Pro? Yeah, he's my friend. I can maybe invite him over one day. She's gonna love that. Red Artist Pro? No way! That's like my favorite chili if you could actually get him to come over, I might consider letting you into my circle. <laughs> oh, don't you worry. Red Artist Pro, besties with them. I grew up with them once I was young, so I can 100% get them to go over and we can have sleepovers. No way sleepovers with Red Artist Pro, that's like the ultimate dream. <laughs> oh my gosh. Little does she know, I'm Red Artist Pro. I'm gonna get ya. Oh, that, that's... <laughs> Mr. East, hey there! My awesome subscribers, welcome back to another insane video on my channel. I hope you're... Right, so he's constantly live. Alright, Mr. East, chill your beans. Don't I have a collab for you? I've just met the famous celebrity Red Artist Pro. That's gonna get him for sure. Well, that sounds absolutely incredible. Meeting a famous celebrity like Red Artist Pro would be a dream come true. Tell me more about this collab. I'm all ears. Well, he's actually at my house right now with my other friend. And he would love to come over and see you. He's been watching your videos. Oh, wait, like Mr. Beast? That's amazing. I can't believe Red Artist Pro has actually been watching my videos. I would absolutely be honored to meet him. Please invite him over. I would love to have a chat and maybe even collab on something epic together. Red Artist Pro goes so far with his editing and he can make you a really edited, full out video that will make you millions of money. Wow, that in sounds incredible. Red Artist Pro- wait, he's changed my name to actually correct. Wait, the Red Artist Pro's not got spaces anymore. <laughs> Do they know me? Red Artist Pro's editing skills must be out of this world. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'm definitely interested in exploring a collaboration that could potentially bring in some epic content and, who knows, even help us make millions! Let's discuss these details and see what we can come up with. Well, Red Artist Pro loves escape rooms and has been doing a lot of escape rooms. 
and he will love to have you join in on one and even host one. Ooh. That sounds absolutely amazing. I'm a huge fan of escape rooms too, and hosting one with Red Artist Pro would be an absolute blast. I'll be more than happy for you to epic escape. Oh, he's just let me in. I was just talking about some random person. He doesn't even know about Regina. Yeah, what he didn't know is that Regina is a vampire. It isn't going to be doing that with you. Well, 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 Mr. East. What brings a YouTuber sensation like you to our humble neighborhood? Up to no good, I bet. Oh, Frank. Well, I've just realized that you've just won a contest and you've got a prize money of 100,000. Gonna love that. It's gonna love that for sure. Nice try, but I don't have time for your games. You're under arrest for suspicious activity. No! You've been arrested! If you have enjoyed this game, definitely make sure to leave a like on this video so I do know that you've enjoyed it. This is my first ever AI game, so don't know if I was that good of it. I'm sure practice will make perfection eventually. If there's any other AI games that I've not heard of that you think I should play, definitely leave those in the comments section below. If you want me to continue this game because I've just realised how many houses there actually is, let me know and hopefully we can conquer this game as well. But thank you everybody for watching and I'll see you all in another video. But bye everybody. Bye.